Well, there is lots of new excitement and enthusiasm when it comes to boosting the effort at community. As News 11's Brennan Leslie explains, the redevelopment of the Wanger Feed Mill building and the new main are great catalysts for what may come in the future. Local officials continue to work diligently to pump new life into the effort of community. Thanks to the new main and the redevelopment plan of the Wenger Feed Mill building, the borough now has two great stepping stones to grow upon. We just see a lot of movement on the ground right now. We have Three Sisters Park that just opened here on Main Street. Also the historic Smithton Inn has weathered vineyards that is just open there as well. And so between the new main and these projects that are happening throughout town, we just hear a lot of energy and enthusiasm lately. The Wanger project plans to release a full report within the coming weeks. Potentially new stores and restaurants may be put in there to further grow the community. A lot of residents say they think new stores and restaurants is exactly what their town needs. But Kathy Orlowski thinks we are in need of something totally different to the area. An organic restaurant would be very nice. Something um, totally organic, uh, everything freshly made with homegrown ingredients. At the end of the day, for this situation at least, change is good. It continues to help bring jobs here, continues to want to motivate folks to open businesses here, to raise families here, and it all goes hand in hand. You know, I always say economic development is a comprehensive process and it involves bringing a lot of different people together. It's not just about business growth, it's about community growth as well. Reporting in Ephrata, Brendan Leslie, News 11.